Hello and welcome to another tutorial from QuickSight.com's tutorial series. In this tutorial we are going to go over how to make text and pictures or other items in your content of your articles or web pages um, have a link associated with them. So to do that, type administrator um, after the last forward slash of your main domain name and enter your login details. and you'll go to content, you'll go to your article manager act like you're creating a new page and let's say I want to make the words click here link to a cool site. To do that you're going to simply highlight the text that you want to turn into a link and if you've got your editor turned on you'll have these icons to help you with this process. You'll notice that there's this chain here and it says to insert edit link. When you click on that a pop-up box will appear. It's going to ask what is the URL that you want this to link to. So it's basically asking these words click here where do you want it to go when the user does that? And of course we want it to go to a cool site, so it's going to go to quicksite.com. In your target, if you don't want the user to actually leave your site, then it's best to select Open in New Window. That way the user always has to see your site one last time before they exit their browsers. Otherwise, if you choose Open in this window, then it just takes you away from their page or takes them away from your page, excuse me. So we want to open this link in a new window. You can select, select a title or a class system for it. And you've got several other options, um, which is a little outside the scope of this tutorial. Have fun with them, check them out. Um, they add a lot of different functionality and features to basic um, hyperlink functions but to just make it work in general to have this text go to a website that you specify and open in a new window um, these are the two fields that are necessary and you would click insert and you'll notice the familiar blue highlights on the click here to go to a cool site that text is now linked to my web page quicksite.com let's say we're wanting to add a picture and we want the picture to link to something. It's the exact same process. You simply insert the picture, you select it, and the hyperlink box comes up. And it doesn't matter if it's a picture or it's text, it treats it the same way. It's an, it's an element and it's going to tie a link that you specify um, to open in a new frame or in the same window when the user clicks on it. And that is how you add links within your web pages. That concludes this tutorial.